So we have with us Mr. Loic, who is the Group Automation Director of FM. A lot of changes happening on Ground Zero, and you are clearly spearheading uh, a bulk of those changes. So uh, tell us about uh, the key trends that you are following in. Uh, and do you feel such inter capital in intensive technology which has so far uh, you know not been readily consumed by the indian market is now making inroads in the way it uh, was envisaged yes uh, indeed uh, today we have several topics to cover because we have uh, as i mentioned just in the presentation mm. the unit picking the pallet picking right and uh, we are looking for more flexibility and scalability in the in the solutions right so uh, just a question to to how to measure the the right level of automation because we see a lot of things there mm. is a lot of automation um available on the Indian market right. so this is not an issue at all uh, today and now the, the question is how to, to identify the, the correct level so we are discussing with the customer we are discussing with all the suppliers in order to to share the best practice coming from our experience coming yeah. from the Indian experience from suppliers and for sure to listen about the strategy for for customer and to create somehow the good compromise between all the parties right right yeah. what has been the biggest challenge in terms of uh, familiarizing people with this sophisticated technology uh, we've always seen <laughs> these in videos uh, when you look at European logistic players but to look at it in India mm -hmm. the auto store or the pallet shuttle yeah. how difficult it has been to convince the Indian mindset uh, uh, absolutely right and it's not a, a question in, in India but uh, for a, any country you, right. you remember 10 20 years ago in France it was the same right uh, but uh, yes we have to prepare the, the new uh, the new automation systems with the facilities with the teams and there is a huge HR point at that mo at that level for training right. and um, and yes and to ramp up the skills of persons right uh, this is important and um, in fact the, the existence of a one project is because you discuss up front with all the parties right. with unions with all the person and to convince that it's better to uh, implement this kind of things and uh, I think it's clear about ergonomics because you see the the the, the evolution of ergonomics through automation is right. a basic because when you are to you have to carry some uh, huge Look. loads, um, automation can highlight this this ergonomics for from a workstations right. from a government point of view. And it's important to, to convince, but it's not so complicated to convince well, uh, from the moment you are just discussing about the quality of work. Right. And it's easy to understand that it's better with automation that, uh, than before. So it's not, it's not uh, complicated, but the way is how to transform the manual process into the, the automated. And this is uh, the, the best challenge, but automation is not in one day. I mean, uh, we have many, perhaps uh, between T0 and the go live, it maybe last one year. Mm. One year is enough to prepare all the team to get to all the trainings, etc. Right. So we have to prepare. It's not easy, mm. but we can do and we have the experience. So, so you, you'll be basically <coughs> busting a myth over here saying that it's not an overnight plug and play solution that an auto store or a, a pallet <laughs> will come uh, is fit in your warehouse and you are good to go. It, it, those kind of manners are involved. Yes, in fact, we have more or less complicated solutions. So, so you see auto store solution is quite easy to implement. Right. This is why it's easy to convince. But on the contrary, you have some uh, really complex system <coughs> I think it's not for today for the Indian market, but um, we have also the experience for that. Not for the all technologies that we that we can find in the market, right? But for the basic one, from uh, it seems already complicated. Auto store is not simple. is It's simple to implement, mm. but inside, it's a really huge technology, really complicated. But what you make simple. A simple in terms of implementation is because all the difficulty is included inside right but we our our purpose is to identify the, the good solution on the market like auto store it's not the only one right but to identify it as um, um, one piece of the puzzle 
and to implement new system in the future and it will be one brick of a global system in the future but right. this is step one right uh, globally if i were to look at an fm logistics warehouse uh, after this implementation uh, would the indian warehouse draw parallels and be at a level playing field with a global fm logistics warehouse or say a global giant like hapag lloyd how how does the implementation in india compare to what you see in the global uh, warehouses um i see in india uh, a huge um motivation mm. in that uh, because uh, the the culture is different mm. and when once you decided to implement something is not the question to um, um to refuse or to uh, to to slow down the project no from the moment where it has been decided once you see through it to the you, implementation you see and everybody is motivated on that right right but it's part of the culture of india uh, and and for sure about the colleague in fm but here i see difference between the countries regards to that and we can be sure that uh, once the project is started you will be at the end but we have to be focused on the all the steps right. like an all the project we have here, right are, we are implementing right uh, to end it if you could crystal gaze for us these are two very promising technologies i know it's early days you're looking at implementation you're working hard towards that but if i were to ask you to project what is to come in the next 5 years uh, you know something that is already perhaps implemented in in the european market or what would that be for india uh, to to me uh, what could be the most um, uh, interesting technology here is um let's say some kind of uh, technology like uh, auto store but kind of okay. that means that for the unit picking really scalable really flexible you can move it from this uh, warehouse to uh, the next uh, just uh, at the rear um we we need this kind of solution uh, for unit pickings like auto store neo from falcon right um and for the pallet pallet uh, picking i think we will have a huge uh, development of emr in the future uh, coming through the, the 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 layer picking and the case picking through robots right uh, and emr will come uh, the will we bring to you the the pallet to you um, and yes we have many uh, use case in mind here okay. and uh, has it really scalable so you can just put one arm one one robot right. and see what happen you can take uh, you can uh, develop a poc uh, test and see what happen we can do many things in india this is a really good laboratory in fact for, right. for this kind of solution right uh, with local partner because the the cost is lower and we we can do easily the things and we can change easily the things it's easy in india for to do, to, right. to do that right so for sure we will we will test a lot of things for, for sure and then develop stronger stronger uh, automation for them all right thank you so much for no, giving us your time thank we you for are really happy that uh, you're bringing in this change thank you thank you to thank you, you. Thank you.